Playoff football returns to Ellen Road. Semi-final, second leg, with the tie all square from the first meeting at Carrow Road on Sunday. Leeds have home advantage and a huge crowd behind them, and they'll be hoping that's good enough to ensure a place at Wembley in the final. Team news for Leeds, one change. Peru comes into the starting eleven. no Sam Byram tonight. Norwich have made a significant change as well. Ashley Barnes is fit again and starts for them. Thurpo in midway inside the Norwich half, comes in field a little way now and then goes out wide again to Somerville. Somerville trying to get past and does get past the defender. And back into Somerville. Somerville in the penalty area, puts it over the top. Well, he had options in the middle, he went alone, and that one sailed over the crossbar. That was a really good chance. Oh, it's a great move, it really is. Wonderful from Jorginho there that flicks it into his path, and you just wonder, was there a better option in the middle of the pitch? Great touch, he looks up, just sees the goal, doesn't he? Tries to find the top corner. Leeds quickly win it back through Rodon, and then... It's picked up just outside the penalty area by McLean, gives it away, and Rodon can move forward for Leeds. Ah, oh, well he's fouled there, Joe Rodon, as he released the ball. Um, Joe Rodon was caught, Leeds have a free kick, what is it, eight yards outside the box? Yeah, it is, but great start, you can see Furpo getting the crowd going, and Perdue as well. This is what you want, high octane, octane start, high press, Norwich trying to play their way out, getting into all sorts of trouble. And here Rodon picks the ball up, goes through, poor challenge wasn't it, from Nunez. Both players step away from the ball. Kamara makes a run across the box. Gruev with the shot! Oh, he's done it! He's absolutely done it! His first goal of the season! What a time to get it! He fooled everybody with a free kick. In it goes! Ellen Road erupts! Leeds United 1, Norwich City 0. Brilliant, brilliant. What a free kick! And he fooled me as well. I thought, for all the world, Somerville, right foot, had to bend it in and put it in. But the keeper, his positioning was so far away. And there's no doubt, in the scouting report, they would have said, right, watch the keeper, Angus Gunn, where he starts from that sort of position. He's way out. Look at that. The, the wall is trying to block. He's there. He's not getting back. He's not getting back in time. And Gruev just slots it home, bends it around the two-man wall and six in the back of the net. Brilliant, Ilya Karev. What a time to score your first goal. Great. Nicely played on to Nonto, who can take on Gibson here as he moves up to the edge of the penalty area. Curls his cross, far post. And it's yes! there by Piru! Yes! What a ball! from Nanto, what a finish from Peru, it's dreamland, Leeds United 2, Norwich City 0. What a tremendous goal, tremendous goal, just watch Peru as soon as Nyonto gets the ball, he is calling for it, he is running to the back post, because stick it in front, stick it in this position, I tell you what, it's alright saying pointing to the ball, but can you deliver, have you got the composure and ability to stick it in the area for the number seven? Well, Nyonto has, of course he has. What a brilliant goal. Archie does well, we work the ball to the spare man and Peru's pointing in front of him, stick it in there. He does, gun again, caught in no man's land and Peru just gets his head to it and nods it past the Norwich keeper. I like to see that, 2-0.
Ball through the middle, just about finds Barnes. And Sargent, oh he's through! Ampadu's missed him, Sargent's through! Melier, what a save from Melier! Like a goal, stretches a long arm out. Sargent was clean through and Melier pushed it behind as he tried to chip the keeper. Incredibly important moment. It certainly was, and that's all about concentration. Ampadu reads it, but somehow misses his interception. He's very good normally at that, but Melier comes out, makes himself huge, and it's a great save with his right arm. The leads with a corner kick. Doesn't look like this one's going to come in short. It looks like it's going to drop in the penalty area from Somerville. Again, arm raised. Battle's going on in the centre of the box. Heads go up! Oh, just wide. Glanced off the head, I think, of Road on there. And everyone stood and watched, and it just carried beyond the far post. So unfortunate. Rodon gets up, gets a touch as well, but couldn't get a, a clean header on target. I thought I could stop my count at about 163, but anyway, no, it continues. Sarah comes to put pressure on Norwich, just trying to up the ante a little bit in terms of that as Leeds get it with Peru. Nice play, Peru. Great play, Peru. He's made space for the run forward. Peru's up to the edge of the penalty area. Two in the middle, behind Somerville. Somerville stumbles, and it comes for Jorginho! Yes! And Jorginho! Yes! It's it into the roof of the net! And a fantastic counter-attack from Leeds results in the third goal! Leeds are flying here! Leeds United 3, Norwich City 0. Oh, fantastic. What a goal, what a goal. And delighted for Jorginho as well. That's exactly what he needed. He started this game ever so well, but really good play, wasn't it? On the far side. Joel Peru, a lot of credit must go to him as well. Picks out the right ball. It's a great turn. He finds plenty of space, but I'm not sure there's a bigger smile out there than on Jorginho Ruter's face. Absolutely wonderful, calm play, good in possession, and see you later here. Gets a little fortunate with the ricochet to him, but after that, kind of four on two now, can you pick out the right man when it comes across to Jorginho, right foot, not his strongest, can he control, although many times he's been in the position, and it's gone high, wide, and not very handsome, well this one's absolutely gorgeous, in the top corner, brilliant goal. Short free kick, gets it back off Giannoulis. Plays it left foot across the edge of the penalty area, headed into the middle. Ampadu and Piru clear. Now Nonto. Nonto wins the ball and plays it through the middle for Somerville. Somerville skips past a challenge and Nonto is through. Willie Nonto racing into the penalty area. Nonto on his right foot. Oh, it's into the chest of the goalkeeper and he beats it away. And Nonto sinks to the ground. He knows that was a heck of a chance for a fourth goal. Oh, it really was. Chianulis goes down far too weak for me. Tries to win a free kick. And after that, we are at Norwich. Never catches him. He takes his time, steadies himself, but a long way out still. And the angle was not that difficult, but didn't quite, again, find the bottom corner. I'm Padoot into... Somerville can look forward. Somerville on to Nonto, gets it back. Peru almost into Perferpo. He's on the right side of the penalty area, across the middle, and it comes back for Jorginho. Still going! Oh, they've bundled it away somehow. Jorginho almost falling as he stabbed that towards goal. And Norwich got bodies behind it on the goal line and just pushed it away from the net. No, oh, but it's great play again, isn't it? We're just carving them open, finding space where it doesn't look like there's any... Angus Gunn again pushes it straight out into a dangerous area and eventually trying to show composure. Jorginho does well, couldn't quite get his shot away before Rowe came in with the challenge. Ampadu, great challenge and ball to Jorginho. He's got options here, Jorginho. Rolls it in. Somerville plays it in. Piru! Oh, what a save from Gunn. 
He was straight through the middle, shot on target, and Gunn reacted brilliantly. Wonderful, wasn't it? Wonderful play. So Chris passing great one-touch play in Peru. Normally he's so good at that, isn't he? That finish, but not this time, couldn't get his second. Nonto. Scarves above heads again. Furpo, good ball to Gray, Jorginho rather. Gray, nice ball in. Somerville header. Yep, yeah, Somerville header. In between the two giant centre halves, he steals in and directs it just over the bar. Well, we've seen a Somerville header before, haven't we, this season? At the back post, rising height. This time gets in between the defenders. Good ball, wasn't it, from Archie Gray. And Stacey just does enough to put him off, but excellent ball, good run, decent leap as well. Stacey asking questions of his fellow defenders as Kamara has it back to Somerville, who's in the penalty area, takes it outside, goes inside with a shot, and Gunner is near post, gets a foot to it, and it goes behind for a corner. Good save, and Gunn is now keeping his side in it, trying to get that fourth goal that will surely put it to bed, but good play, Somerville driving into the box, just gets the defender, wrong-footed, and a good stop. Gibson Worth goes in to win it misses out though Norwich find their space down the left hand side Sarah in the centre circle good challenge Jorginho he's got runners he's played it to Somerville and Somerville's on the edge of the penalty area Somerville can shoot Piru oh keeper saves again once more Joel Piru only the keeper in front of him and once more it's Gunn who thwarts his hopes of scoring another goal Leeds get the ball back quickly, come again, Somerville wants more. They were queuing up then, the Leeds players in the penalty area. Well, Gunn yet again, it's another really good stop, but well played. Clever ball, wasn't it, from Somerville as well. Ball is won in the air by McLean, Bruyth underneath it. Now, Somerville with a chance to run at Norwich, plays it into Nonto. Nonto's on the edge of the area, swipes his shot in, Firpo cuts it yeah! back! Somerville scores for Leeds and that surely is the goal that sends Leeds through to the playoff final. Norwich cut apart again and Somerville has his goal. Leeds have a fourth. Some night this. Leeds United 4, Norwich City nil. It's a wonderful goal, wonderful team goal. Yet again, carved them open for the umpteenth time. And this time we do take advantage in the second half. It's been coming. We've had one, two, three chances. Peru does really well. Find Somerville in space. And when Yonto gets it, love the overlap. Firpo just keeps going. Gunn should have done better with the shot. But the awareness of Firpo rolls it into Somerville. And he won't score an easier goal. What we've deserved would have been four goals better. It's 4-0. He scored his first goal of the season in the penultimate game as it's turned out of the season. So important, what a goal. And really good defensive work as well. And here we see it again. Angus Gunn just no idea that's going to go to the near post. <laughs> Lots of way of scoring a goal and that's a clever way. And the discussion around the way he predicted that outcome will go on for some time to come. Liam Cooper, big hugs from Gruev, big hugs for Gruev. And Liam Cooper, Captain Cooper, goes to take his place in the heart of the Leeds defence once more. Yeah, Ampadu will just push into that midfield holding role. It's all over. Leeds United are heading to Wembley. Leeds United are one game away from a return to the Premier League. 
after absolutely hammering Norwich City here in this playoff semi-final second leg. 3-0 up at half-time, chances galore in the second half, just one more went in, but this is as big a beating as you will have seen Leeds administer to anybody all season long. Fantastic performance from Leeds United, and now a huge day awaits. May the 26th, Leeds United back at Wembley, the prize a place in the Premier League. What a night, what celebrations we're seeing around Ellen Road. It's been magnificent. It's finished, Leeds United 4, Norwich City 0. Well, from start to finish, absolutely magnificent from the boys. With so much pressure on this game, this time they handled it really well. They knew this was their last chance, it's a one-off game to get to Wembley. They needed to perform, they needed to step up and show what they can do well. I think we just saw it. Absolutely brilliant, some really good play, really good goals, and a vital save at the right time from Melier. Key moments all went our way, but we needed our front four to fire. Well, they certainly did that. That man there, Jorginho, got back into some great form, playing with plenty of confidence, and that clean sheet. I tell you what, I'm looking forward to this Wembley final now. Ten days before we do it all again, but if you asked me a couple of weeks ago what I think the chances were that we'd get back in the Premier League, I'd say, well, I'm not so sure. Now, we've got a really good chance. Heads down, work hard for the next 10 days, get there and produce again.